from a Taylor Swift impact wall to personal baby photos to her very own handwritten lyrics, the Taylor Swift experience at the Grammy Museum at LA Live has it all. ET Online has an exclusive all access pass before it opens December 13th, which also happens to be her 25th birthday. You'll get to see and engage in different interactives where you can play with the levels on her voice, on her famous song, Mean. Or you'll get to sing along, We Are Never Getting Back Together. So tell me about this giant boom box. All right. So we're pulling from in our inspiration from pieces in the music video. I go on too many dates. <laughs> We always want to incorporate some sort of photo op in the exhibition, so this giant boom box is perfect for that. So we can get folks taking pictures. We have this really cool LED light up floor. So when you're dancing to shake it off, you can do your own twerking, you can do your own dancing here. And they light up. And they light up as you move on. And we couldn't shake off just how stunning her gowns are. Oh my gosh, is this the Gucci dress from the Grammys this year? Yes, I mean, just looking at the craftsmanship that went into making this dress, and just handmade every single stitch, every single piece, every single jewel on this dress, um, is just absolutely phenomenal and perfect for a Grammy award show. This was the gown that she wore when she accepted, you know, album of the year, artist of the year. I mean, she just took it all. All of so. the awards. Clearly, Taylor knows how to write a hit song, and her handwritten lyrics for Teardrops on My Guitar, White Horse, and 22 are all on display. But before she was writing hit songs, she was just a small town girl from Pennsylvania. Tell me about this adorable cutie. So this is a collection of photographs, again, that Andrea, her mother, and Taylor hand-selected from their photo album. Here is her first press kit that she was passing around when her family moved to Nashville and she's going down to the different record labels on Music Row. This was her press kit, not a traditional one where you have a photo, a bio, and maybe a demo track. Her and her mom actually worked on these together to add a personal touch to it. Grammy winning executive director Bob Santelli also hopes visitors take away Taylor's story going from Southern girl to superstar. Taylor Swift is the most important recording artist and performer in the world today. And to tell her story, to look at what she has done in such a short period of time, uh, to gain some insight, gain some context, some inspiration even for some artists and fans, that's what we want, want to do. You can check out the entire exhibit in Los Angeles when it opens on December 13th until May 10th, 2015.